at the start of the pandemic, actually, a lot of people were interested in bringing a dog or a puppy into their home, whether it was fostering or adopting. I remember the first two days of the governor's orders uh, to shut down, we received 300 applications to foster and adopt at Detroit Dog Rescue. So we were able to get a lot of dogs into homes. And what we did is we created this emergency relief plan um, with Detroit Animal Care and Control to get more dogs out of their municipal shelter where they might be in danger of being euthanized. And they've done a great job. So by working together, we really mitigated euthanizing a lot of pets and brought a lot more animals into our shelter. But it goes farther than that. As we've progressed over the last you know, six or eight months, we're seeing, unfortunately, people have a loss of income. Um, people's lives have completely changed. A lot of people I know, especially in Oakland County, in our area, um, may have adjusted their work schedules to teach their children, or be, myself included. Um, and what we saw, again, was a loss of income. We had really great pet owners in Detroit, people who love their dogs, but they just needed three or six months worth of dog food to get by. I think we take for granted how much really dog food and pet products and pet care cost. So we helped to mitigate that cost by providing our outreach families with food or vaccinations, um, pet licenses, things like that to really relieve some of that stress of owning a pet. Um, it's something that we did when Detroit Dog Rescue started during the foreclosure crisis. You know, we started in some of the worst economic times in Detroit. And what we did is we really worked with families and we really worked with people who love their pets so they could keep their pets in their home. And I think that's important to remember Nobody wants to euthanize animals in the shelter. And one of the ways to avoid that is by realizing that sometimes first home is best home. You know, if you have a dog and you're a great pet owner and your dog loves you and you love your dog, the last thing I wanna do is take your pet out of your home and put it in my shelter. Now, if I need to help raise funds to provide your dog with medical care or food, but you're providing love and attention to your dog, why would I ever want that dog in the shelter? And what I love is we get to keep up with these outreach families. So throughout the pandemic, we were able to check in on everybody and really help keep pets with their people. And that's so important to me and the entire crew at Detroit Dog Rescue.